there's a global public health threat on the horizon that not enough people are talking about. If we don't tackle this problem, it has the potential to become a global humanitarian crisis, responsible for at least 10 million lives lost yearly by 2050, more than cancer. It's antimicrobial resistance, AMR. It is estimated that bacterial AMR was directly responsible for 1.27 million global deaths in 2019 and contributed to 4.95 million deaths. What is antimicrobial resistance? Antimicrobials are medicines used to prevent and treat infections in humans, animals and plants. The microbes that cause infection can develop resistance to these medicines. Widespread misuse and overuse of antibiotics and other antimicrobials has led to the global spread of drug-resistant microbes known as antimicrobial resistance. Without action, we are heading for a post-antibiotic era where a common infection or routine surgical procedure could become life-threatening. It is possible to control the spread of drug resistance, but medical breakthroughs alone will not be the solution to this invisible health crisis. So what do we do? First, we need to raise awareness. Please share this video with your friends, family and colleagues. Next, we need to change our behavior as a society. We can control the spread of antimicrobial resistance and keep antibiotics working, but everyone needs to make behavioral changes to combat its causes, to ensure antimicrobials are used appropriately. If you or anyone in your family are prescribed antibiotics, take them exactly as prescribed and never save them for later or share them with others. As part of this, ensure you finish the prescribed course of antibiotics. Stopping your prescribed course early could allow some of the bacteria to remain in the body, reproduce and emerge as a resistant strain. Together, we can make a difference and ensure that antibiotics continue to be the life-saving treatment they are for many more years to come. Prevention is better than cure. We need to develop sustainable solutions before mortality soars. The time to act is now.